Oh, my armada will finally destroy the Power Rangers. That's what you think, Prince Vicar. Super Mega Silver! Super Mega Silver! Final Strike! <laughs> Power Rangers! It's a Super Mega Showdown. We're gonna start by taking a look at Prince Vicar. Mega Force and Super Mega Force had a variety of villains, basically because the series was cobbled together from two different Sentai series. It made for kind of a, an awkward story with uh, villains coming in and out of the, the storyline. Vicar was a pretty important character, uh, but he, he didn't do a lot of direct combat, although that's often typical with the main villain. The Prince Vicar action figure is very regal looking with his white, blue, and gold paint scheme. He's also got a little bit of silver details there. I really do like the chrome blue paint they used on him. He has articulation at the head. It only turns side to side a little bit before his face hits his collar. He's got these large shoulder pads that do hinder his shoulder articulation, although he has good shoulders. Uh, they just don't can't move around all the way. He's also got elbow joints. He might have wrist articulation, but it's... I can't tell because I can't reach inside his little gold fringy sleeves. Uh, he's got a lot of cool like locks and medallions on his chest there. And he's got long tails to his coat. They get in the way of articulation a little bit, but they're not too bad. He's got pretty good range with his hips. He's also got knee joints. He looks incredible though. I really think they did a great job. The level of paint details on him is pretty good. I don't know if there's too much they left unpainted that, that really um, stands out as being a missing detail. I, like, I really like how he turned out. Here's Orion, the Super Mega Force Silver Ranger. He was an alien ranger, came from another planet, although looks completely humanoid. This is a theme we see often in Power Rangers. They could not carry over Robo Knight from the first half of Mega Force into Super Mega Force because the Sentai footage just wasn't going to match up. And later, the Silver Ranger and Robo Knight are in the Legacy Battle footage together. So they needed a different Six Ranger for the second half or the second season of Mega Force. It's kind of a weird choice. I liked Robo Knight a lot, and Orion was just kind of okay. His action figure comes with a gold version of his Super Silver Spear. In the show, this transforms from a blaster into the spear, uh, and he also had like a Super Mega Mode that had this crazy armor thing with the faces of all the six Rangers on it. Uh, it was a little bit bizarre, but I think this figure does a great job of representing the regular version of the character. He's got his skull cap looking thing here with the design on it which I never realized in the show was like a pirate bandana until I saw it on the action figure. Uh, he's got his tall coat here that does hinder his neck articulation some. Great paintwork on the chest here with the black and white shirt with the silver and gold coat over top. He's got great range of motion in the shoulders, elbow joints, and glove cut joints here at the wrists. No articulation in his waist, but I do like the sculpting on his ranger key there and his belt. He does have a long coat. It is made out of a flexible material to help it get out of the way. It does hinder articulation a little bit at the hip, but it's not too bad. He also has knee joints and a boot articulation. This is a pretty good figure of Orion. Uh, when the Super Mega Force figures came out, I found it very odd that they were a different scale than the Mega Force figures. I really liked the Mega Force figures. I think they had a slightly more accurate proportions. They kind of beefed up the characters a little bit for Super Mega Force, uh, but we've seen this scale carry on for quite a while in the line. Hey boys and girls, thanks for watching this super exciting outrageous tour review. Today, we took a look at the Good vs. Evil Power Rangers Super Mega Force Silver Ranger vs. Prince Vicar. This was a Walmart exclusive. Make sure to like, subscribe, and check out our other videos.